This is a DSC PK5501 keypad. It's an icon keypad, so you'll notice that we don't have uh, the full display on this one. So it's a little bit trickier to uh, change codes, add codes and stuff. You just got to go um, by kind of in your mind what you're doing here. So um, I'll take a little bit longer maybe explaining this one. So um, just like all the other DSC systems, we're going to hit, uh, to add a code, we hit star 5. And then we enter the master code, which is one, two, three, four. Okay, and you'll see there the program light comes on, 40 is flashing, and the arm light comes on. So don't be afraid. You go, oh, I'm trying to change the code, and I armed the system. No, this is just letting you know that you're in programming, uh, mainly with that program flashing there. So the nice thing about these icons is it's flashing and telling you what is programmed. So code 40 is programmed, and that's where the master code is. So we're going to change the master code. So in order to do that, we need to... It, you need, we need to press, oh, am I timed out here? Yeah, I gotta just do star five here, put in the code again, go back into that menu. Okay, so 40's program, so we're gonna hit 40. Okay, so now I've selected 40, you'll see it's solid there, and I'm gonna put in four, three, two, one, I'm gonna change it. So now I've changed the master code. I went into programming, hit 40, uh, the code was one, two, three, four, I changed it to four, three, two, one. Okay, and I can hit the pound button to exit out of the menu and now that's my uh, master code here so if I want to go back in I have to hit star 5 and if I try using 1234 okay it doesn't work it gives me an error there because I've changed it to star 5 4 3 2 1 okay so I know my master is working because if it wasn't I wouldn't be able to get into the programming there and we're gonna add a few so on this one, the trickiest thing for people is uh, you always have to use two digits. So um, if we want to change code number one, we have to hit zero one. Okay, and now it just shows one. Okay, but the programming, the way it works, you need to enter two digits. So I'm going to put in one, 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 one. And now you'll see on the screen, one flashes, 40 flashes, one flashes, 40 flashes. So now it's telling you what's programmed. So we could pick, uh, this is a, a PC1616 panel, so I can hit, um, let's hit 15. Okay, so I've selected code 15, and I'll put in 1515, 15, just for easy, easiness sake. So now you'll see that 15's program there. So it's nice, if you got 10 codes programmed, so let's do a couple other ones, let's go 08. Put 8888 in there, and we'll go to 10. Okay, and put in 1010. Okay, so I just wanted to do a bunch of random ones so you can see even if you kind of have a messy uh, setup and it's not very organized, you can still kind of clearly see where codes are on this one. It just keeps cycling through all the, the numbers and codes that are programmed. So we want to delete all of these out. So all you do is select the code again. So we know code 1 is uh, programmed because it was flashing there. And so I select 0, 01 to select it again. Okay, and I can either put in a new code over top of it, like I could put in 2222. Two, two, two. Okay, so code one now has two, 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 two in there, okay. But if I want to delete it, I'm going to hit uh, zero, one to select code one again. And you press the star button to delete it. And now you'll notice that one is not flashing anymore, so it's going to cycle through. So our next one is eight, so I'm going to go zero, eight, and zero, or star, sorry, star to delete it. And now we have 10, we'll hit 10, star to delete it, 15, star to delete it. You notice you're just doing the same thing over and over again. And now just 40 is flashing and we're going to go to 40 and I'm going to change it to 1, 2, 3, 4. Change it back to what it originally was. And now I'm done all my programming. I'm going to hit pound and exit out. And there we go. We got our codes all put in there. We took them all back out and we changed the master code and then reset it back to 1, 2, 3, 4.